I am the supplier and today I'm gonna do a sticky note review in video. For no good reason. So one of the things that I do typically on Instagram and Snapchat is sticky note reviews wherein I write a review of a book on a sticky note because really that's all I have time for being, you know, a full-time teacher and a graduate student. And I've missed making videos and I couldn't figure out what to do for a video so I thought I would just turn the camera on and read to you one of my sticky notes. So yesterday I finished Love in the Time of Global Warming by Francesca Lea Blah and I loved it. So the basic premise of the story is this. Penn survives this huge earth shaker wherein a lot of people died and there were tsunamis and things and she's in Los Angeles and she sets off on a journey, kind of like Odysseus, to find her family except he was trying to find home. She's got some powers, and she meets some other teenagers with powers, and they all band together to go and find her family. And here is my sticky note, which I know you can't read, so I'm going to read it to you. It says, I am not done with these characters yet! While I didn't see this novel as particularly deep, uh, ties to Homer felt rather superficial. And there's a lot of belief that has to be suspended. Um, I can't go wrong with a monster slaying group of queer teens as they try to survive post-apocalyptic times. There is a clear absence of adults, save for one, and he has a tendency to show up right when needed. Uh, but that's okay too. Um, I think about it this way. These are the ventures that Penelope <laughs> would have had if she hadn't stayed home and waited for Odysseus. So, have you read Love in the Time of Global Warming by Francesca Leah Block? If you want to have a conversation, leave it in the comments and I'll see you there soon. Until then, I'm the supplier, wishing you happy reading. Don't forget to be awesome. Hello! Welcome to the In Screen, where I tell you all about the places you can find me on the internet. My website is thebooksupplier.com, and you can find me at the Book Supplier at all of those places listed up in the corner, and I really hope I'm pointing in the right direction. Also, you can subscribe to the channel down here in this corner, and below you can leave comments. I like talking to people on the internet. Leave comments. Okay, I'm actually going to get out of here now.